Skeletal muscle damage elicits a sterile immune response that facilitates complete regeneration. This dynamic process is characterized by initial production of pro-inflammatory mediators, including cytokines and chemokines, by resident cells at the site of injury that is followed by rapid myeloid cell recruitment. Termination of pro-inflammatory mediator production and subsequent apoptotic cell clearance defines the beginning of the resolution phase of acute inflammation, which couples to tissue repair and regeneration. Several studies have shown that macrophages are involved in all phases of regeneration, including restriction of damage, clearance of the necrotic debris and apoptotic cells, and repair of the damaged tissue. This highly dynamic process is characterized by an in situ transition of infiltrating monocyte to an inflammatory and later to a repair macrophage phenotype, which is indispensable for proper regeneration. Furthermore, lipid mediators play key roles in regulating both the initiation and resolution of acute inflammation. They are rapidly generated by immune cells and have direct receptor-mediated actions on immune cells, including neutrophils and macrophages. In this study, by using two distinct models of acute muscle injury in mice, we elucidate dynamic regulation of the mediator lipidome during sterile skeletal muscle tissue inflammation and regeneration. We identified temporal regulation of glycerophospholipids and production of pro-inflammatory and specialized pro-resolving lipid mediators, which could be modulated by ibuprofen. These time-dependent profiles were recapitulated in sorted neutrophils and muscle-infiltrating macrophages, with a distinct pro-resolving signature observed in reparative macrophages. Focusing on Resolvin D2, a specialized pro-resolving lipid mediator, we showed that it affects the transcription program of naive macrophages in vitro, equipping them with a unique gene signature, and promotes their phenotypic transition from inflammatory to reparatory macrophages in vivo. Lastly, Resolvin D2 intramuscular administration results in functional improvement and recovery of the regenerating muscle in a model of delayed muscle repair. Taken together, our results reveal dynamic lipid mediator signatures of inflammatory and tissue reparative immune cells and demonstrate that macrophages are both sources and sensors of lipid mediators that potentially facilitate phenotypic transitions.